the guys came out this morning with a um, great attitude. I thought they detailed the entire practice. Thought they were. I, I, I love their focus in all three phases of the game. I think they understand that we got to go in there and play at a high level. We're playing a very good football team, and it's a great one of the greatest venues in college football that you can that you can play in. So we got to be ready for the challenge, and um, I think they're gonna they're gonna be ready for it. No, Casey. Casey did not practice. Uh, he threw a little bit yesterday, and he threw a little bit today. So is he officially out? Yes. Do you know? Uh, you might not want to say. Do you know though who you want to go with at quarterback to start that game, or what's the thought there right now? I think we all going to find out Saturday about three thirty. I'll let you guys know. How do you feel? Uh, Anthony kind of got going a little bit again last week. How do you feel he's been uh, like seeing the holes? And you, you've talked about getting those three or four yards, or mm -hmm. there's some plays where he's got to just kind of get those yards sometimes. Or yeah. Yes, Anthony, we, we talked about it, but you know, it's with running backs. The the run the running backs that gain a lot of yards is block clean every play. It's, it's it's a clean block. But when it's not there, I don't want him to bounce it. I want him to knock a hole in it, put a dent in the defense. But we we got as coaches, we got to be happy with three yards. You know, we got to we got to be happy with that. Yes, they they have to go in. They have to step in. Um, with Miles not being in there, but uh, I have faith in those two kids that they that they'll get it done. You know, this is a, probably the D line rotation. I mean, that's a Dawson and Bush conversation mostly, but a lot of different guys are playing there. I mean, are you happy with how they rotated those guys in fresh? Yes, we talk about it um, before every game how the rotation is going to be with each position. And that rotation, I'm, I'm happy with that rotation because I think in that, that D-line position, you got to play multiple bodies. And I think Doss does a really good job of with his rotation. And if I don't like it, I'll, I'll, I'll let him know. But I'm happy with that. What kind of progress did you see out of one of Same thing, same as last week, you know. They, they, they had good practice. They had a good practice. They practiced well. But you don't get graded on practice. You get graded on game day. So it's about who can manage the team on game day. You know, just like they say about coaching, this would be a great profession if we didn't have to play the games. But we had to play the games. So they got to be able to manage this team during the game. I mean, you can do it at practice, but now I got to see you manage this team during the game. Well, yes, I think the, the, the number one thing we had to do, we got to be able to hand that ball off. Hand the ball off. Slow it down. That's what we. That's what we got to do. Coach Casey, you know the ultimate competitor over really, the last two weeks, not being able to play. What have you seen from him as a leader in terms of helping Logan and Shelby get ready? Well, he's been in every meeting, and he's been in every practice. You know, in the air. You know, you know, talking to him. But, but Casey wants to play. Like you say, he wants to play. He's a competitor. He wants to play. But he understands right now that he he can't play at a high level, so we won't put him out there. But he's been really good as a leader out there with those with those um, young quarterbacks. Yes. Play for it. Do you sense the guys are rallying around that opportunity idea this weekend? Yes, because I don't, I, I don't think they back down from anybody since I've been here. I, don't, I, I mean, since before I got here, you can watch them. They don't, they don't back down. They, they don't throw in a white flag. So you got to respect that out of those kids that, you know, they, they're, they're busting their butts, not getting the results that they want. But they understand that this is a great opportunity, and I explain to them that Michigan is playing for something. You're not playing a Michigan team. That's, they they plan to be a number one seed in the um, BCS championship. So we understand that. But I think they, they're okay. They understand the opportunity. Talk about the ball more. Is Gabe still on track to more today? Yes, he practiced all week, so he looked good all week. So he's, he'll be available. No, never, never coached there. You know, but I, I mean, it's a great venue. You know, you hear about it all the time, but at the end of the day, you know, the game's going to be played. I don't think I'll be focused on, you know, I won't be in awe, you know, because it's football. Speaking of the big house, last, this season has been some incidents with the tunnel. Mm -hmm. James Franklin was talking about it in the Michigan State situation. Do you do anything differently about just the ins and outs of 
that one tunnel to avoid any potential situations like that? No, I, I have faith in um, University of Michigan administration that they're going to do everything in their power to make sure we don't have altercation. Um, we're going to make sure our kids get in the tunnel, and we have a plan to make sure our kids get in the tunnel and get in there and, and get in there safely. But we, we're not we're not going there for that. We're not we're not talking about you know the altercation, what happens in the tunnel. We're going to be professional like we always we always are, and we're going to get our kids in and get our kids out. But I don't I don't see a problem happening. No, I, I've been knowing this kid since he's been 15. He, I mean, you're gonna you're gonna have some bad games. You you play you play football long enough. You do anything long enough. You're gonna have some bad some bad days. And he he's come back this week to practice. But no, he would never lose confidence. He's not built like that.